This is a question on rational functions. This is a very straightforward question and in the core three paper you have to be getting this right. These are really four very straightforward marks. It says express the following as a single fraction in its simplest form. In a red pen I will show you some of the common mistakes. The first thing is to launch straight into it and uh, without trying to factorize and cancel. So the first mistake that people try and do is they they're trying to deal with this here and what they say is they say well to subtract fractions you need a common denominator so this one needs to be multiplied by 3x plus 1 and this one needs to be multiplied by 3x plus 1 and this one needs to be multiplied by 9x squared minus 4 and this one by 9x squared minus 4. Now the problem with this is this leads you on then to start expanding out brackets and you can never refactorize, refactorize or put it in its simplest form. Other common mistakes include, include just multiplying out brackets wrong. However, let's just do this very simply. The first step is to try to factorize so the expression. So the top of the first uh, fraction cannot be factorized. Can 9x squared minus 4 be factorized? Yes, it's a difference of two squares. Difference of two squares. The first of the four marks is for factorizing the denominator of this into 3x plus 2, 3x subtract 2. You should always be looking out for the difference of two squares. Now, the next fraction, nothing can be cancelled. That there is your first mark. Then, if you spot that you can cancel the 3x plus 2 from the top and the bottom, you can divide both sides by, uh, divide top and bottom by 3x plus 2, that is your second mark as simple as that. So you have two out of four marks. Then you would write three over, uh, sorry, two uh, over three x subtract two, subtract two over three x plus one. Okay, now you're trying to add fractions, they're as simple as possible, so what you need to do is make them have the same denominator. This one needs to be multiplied by three x plus one on top and bottom, and the other one needs to be multiplied by 3x subtract 2 on top and bottom. Okay, so you would get 2, 3x plus 1, subtract 2, 3x subtract 2, all over 3x subtract 2, 3x plus 1. Now you need to, you should have your equals going down the page here, by the way. Now you should multiply these out. This would be 6x plus 2. And this will be minus 6x plus 4. Now at this stage, just a careful note, that subtract means uh, negative 6x. It does not mean subtract 4 as well. You have multiplied out the negative 2 of the brackets. This means you have 6x and you subtract 6x and they go. And you have positive 2 and you add 4. And so you get, and this should be on the line below, but I've run out of space, 6 over 3x subtract 2, 3x plus 1. And where did you get your other marks? Well, you got your other marks by trying to put them over a common denominator. There's the third mark. And the fourth mark was for getting the correct answer.